this is Bruce from Rucksack Nation. We're out on a day hike here in the great UP, the Upper Peninsula of Michigan. And what we have here is Old Man's Beard. And what this is, it is a it is known as a lichen, which is the symbiotic relationship between a photosynthetic algae and a fungus. And it produces um, these algae or excuse me, these lichen blooms like this. This is a fully mature um, this is a fully mature old man's beard that has many medicinal uses that have been found used throughout history. It contains oozenic acid, which has given rise to the to the name of the color that uh, that old man's beard is, which is known as oozenia. Its its uh, scientific name is oozenia, and what this oozenic acid has been found to do it has many antimicrobial properties. It's particularly antifungal. And what this would be used for uh, by by primitive man would be to treat to treat uh, skin conditions such as uh, such as ringworm, which when you're out in the bush, you're playing in the dirt, you're sweating, you're not getting out of your clothes and bathing as often, you're at a higher risk of getting contracting ringworm. So knowing how to use oozenia and its oozenic acid would be greatly beneficial. This has also been known to be made into a tea to extract the oozenic acid to treat internal parasites, which again, you are at a higher risk of contracting if you're in some sort of survival situation, especially a prolonged one, where you might not always be capable of treating your water. And this may help in the treatment and prevention of internal parasites. Uh, bear in mind it should be, you should be very careful when using this to treat any internal ailment because it will most likely take out a lot of the natural flora and fauna that's within your gut as well as the uh, parasitic um, worms and such. This has been Bruce with Rucksack Nation. Thanks for watching, and this is Usnia, also known as Old Man's Beard.